we're standing in the courtyard outside of a hammam or bathhouse and we're bringing the tools directly to the sites here in Erbil. Uh, we're up in the citadel in the center of the city, the oldest part of, uh, of this city, and um, using the tools to, to document this, uh, this site. And it's very encouraging to see how eager and how quickly they've learned to uh, put these tools to use. Uh, it's been really encouraging to see how the students in this program have uh, really latched on to the technology that we've been teaching them, um, both here back in Suleimania, here in Erbil. Um, they are really eager to get these tools, to use them, to uh, document the sites that they're trying to promote, and also use the tools to uh, make people outside of Kurdistan outside of Iraq aware of these uh, very important heritage sites and uh, in some ways to make these sites available to people who will never be fortunate enough to come to visit Kurdistan uh, or Iraq. Yeah, I can see that this year the students showed immediately that what we were teaching was becoming part of their, of their everyday work in the departments or in the SBH in Baghdad, in, on the sites they are responsible for. A lot of people aren't able to come to Iraq uh, for a variety of reasons and uh, one of the cool things with these tools is that uh, they can create virtual, immersive, really engaging virtual tours of some of these incredible sites. Uh, there's a student in the course um, named Mohammed who has created a virtual tour of an archaeological site outside Suleimania and he has already had over 14,000 people from around the world come and visit and engage with that site in a way that they have never been able to do before. For the last couple of years we've been talking about how we need a map of archaeological sites in the Kurdish region and Mohammed has put one together where you can look at the sites where they are and see some of the pictures which is wonderful. Uh, in my opinion, such program we hear is um, highly needed, um, specifically in our context, I mean here in Kurdistan region, because for a long time we have been excluded for, from such activity like excavation, doing excavation, survey and documentation. So we had a module on uh, charters, a module site management planning, another module on conservation, could be stone conservation or mudbury conservation, we had a, legal, a module on legal issues and risk management. Another module was dedicated to natural site and how natural site uh, are combined to cultural site. And so we had experts who are working on natural issues in Iraq and some of them are working on the cultural issues together. So they, we wanted to show this also to the students because the students sometimes tend uh, to work only on cultural uh, elements. Uh, ورش اللي أقامتها WMF وفرت لنا فرصة لزيارة موقع بازيان وقدرت أن أنجز بحث من خلال هذه الزيارة وشاركت في هذا البحث في مؤتمر الدراسات الجيولوجية للآثار الذي أقيم في قسم الجيولوجي كلية العلوم جامعة بغداد في الفترة من 14-15 إلى 16 أبريل عام 2015 قدمت الباحث والقيتة بالمؤتمر وتم اختياري عضو في اللجنة العلمية لهذا المؤتمر 
نتيجة مشاركتي بهذا البحث اللي تم إنجازه بإشراف خبراء من WMF I think the importance we've seen lately, the importance of documenting these places as the places disappear. You know, every week or two in the news, there's a new thing that's disappeared because of ISIS. And a lot of these projects that have been waiting for the last few decades, you know, soon we're going to get to it and soon we're going to be able to document it. But, you know, it's urgent to do it now before things disappear. In this period, I mean, during the last four or five years, uh, the training that uh, we are suggesting from UNESCO with the help of institutions like the World Monuments Fund is more dedicated to the urgent matters. Because here uh, the, the question is not a normal uh, uh, pra practice of, the, uh, uh, of a, a, a people in charge of monuments or in charge of uh, uh, archaeological sites, in charge of museums. The, the question which is uh, uh, facing the colleagues here is this urgency. يعني النقطة المهمة اللي استفادتها من الدورات إنه قبل كنا ننظر فقط للتحديات اللي تحيط بالموقع لكنه الآن صارت عندنا فتفسحة من الأمل وصار عندنا نشاطات أكيد نتيجة لهذه الدورة الفائدة اللي حصلناها منها فبلشنا نشتغل وبلشنا نفكر ونطمح إنه نخلي خطة إدارة آني على المستوى الشخصي استاذ توانم لا كاما باش دستي بيب كام يان تشتيك بيويستا بو دولمنت الكردي او زان يارنا كهمانا شو بو ديكومنت كردنا شو بو نوجان كردنا وا اللي يشوف تشوف المنظمات الدوليه يعني يعني على مستوى دولي وبالتالي هسه احنا بدنا نحضر خطه اداره كامله او شامله للموقع ايما اللي استاذ بيوستي شي اكزار زور من بو هم خلقانا يا كيارمتي مام دنيا يارمتي عراق تن بو بتوانين خلي زياتر لم بوارب كينوا بو من دنيا كوا صندوق اثار عالمي بشمان لينا كبلكو دبي نقل من دبي لا عند بو زياتر بربو بوارب زين